ILERA for more than 50 years has promoted the, the study of work and, and labor relations. It's truly international and we are constantly trying to extend our global reach so we can address pressing issues in labor conditions and the world of work uh, throughout the world. As it broadened out and more different countries came in at different stages of development, the interest of ILERA broadened because people from these countries said, well, it's very wonderful to talk about a developed economy, but it doesn't have much to say to us. But we have different issues. Now, because of globalization, the issues in some of those countries are now recognized as impacting on the United States. Particularly in the Asia-Pacific region, which are different stages of industrialization. Uh, so Japan, Korea, China, obviously, these are more advanced. Throughout my presidency, I'm going to try and encourage, particularly in Southeast Asia, in Africa, and parts of Latin America, where we don't yet have a national organization that's equivalent to LIRA, through the uh, engagement with ILIRA, we're trying to foster the development of such a national organization in each of those countries and each of those regions, helping, uh, particularly in the developing countries, to develop the profession of human resource management and labor relations and labor policy, labor rights, the uh, concern about work conditions, concerns about child labor, uh, concerns about the health and safety of uh, workers, and all sorts of policy questions where ILERA expertise can provide assistance as those countries uh, work to improve uh, work conditions and working lives. We are able to advance important research on issues of importance for the world of work from a number of different disciplines. And uh, furthermore, through ILERA, we can address global societal challenges with an impact on labor conditions and the world of work.